Okay. Hi everyone. We are standing out uh, right in front of the Capitol uh, with the Supreme Court behind us and just rejoicing in the wonderful news from the Supreme Court. And we're just so thankful for the brave Supreme Court justices and President Trump for uh, nominating them and, and putting them on the Supreme Court so that this day could finally come. Absolutely. It's, it's a historical day. I think um, I've said this many times. I think that's one of the things that as long as there's some good folks out there fighting for the unborn that, that our nation isn't wiped off the face of the map. And I couldn't be happier. Couldn't be happier. I, I was uh, thinking of things about my mama this morning and my daddy and how strong they were in the pro-life movement and just instilled that value in me. And so it's just, we really are rejoicing. Yes, our hearts are full, and we want to thank everyone uh, that has worked for so many years in this movement and, and prayed and, and protested and written letters and, and just everything that you've always done. Don't give up the fight. The fight really begins now because now that this has been overturned, it goes back to the states uh, where right. they'll, they'll make their own laws. That's right. It's not, a, it's not over. This is, a, this is not a, a, a peak. This is, I guess you call it, a plateau. we got to build on it. Yes, yes, so don't forget there's states like New York that have laws uh, to, to kill babies up until the day of birth. Those are the places that we need to really do the work. And, and then also just continue to support the movement, continue to pray, and today is a great celebration.